Well, afternoon, Viva MK. Thank you for once again joining me on this Viva MK live midday update on Thursdays, albeit next week it will be on Friday at six o'clock because it will be the pre-showcase special when I'll give you all you need to know about the showcase that will be no more than 48 hours away. So next week, join me at 6 p.m. on Friday for a Viva MK showcase, new beginnings showcase update. Today, really, I want to talk about three things, catalogs, products, and then of course, the showcase in itself. So beauty catalogue, the forthcoming health and beauty catalogue, and that it's in pre-production now. I've got some more pages to show you from it today. And of course, last week's exposure on the pages caused a lot of excitement. Now, people said, are we trying to compete with anybody? No, absolutely not. Years and years and years ago, in Clean Easy, we launched a health and beauty catalogue, which was very, very, very successful and became the core of the business and what we had to offer along the main catalog. So what I'm trying to do is to try and recreate some of that excitement in a dedicated catalog that has things to do with health and beauty, which as you know, can be quite a wide range of products. So for example, last week I showed you some of the pages and some of the products that are going to be in there. More importantly, it wasn't so much about the products, it was more to do with the, the layout and the look of the catalog. You know, bright, bold colors, bright, bold products, but more about the look. And again, I can demonstrate that in other pages that I've got here. Again, a very bright, bold look. Um, if you see there, you know, some, some, some of the products that are going to be featured in that catalog that is just being created as we speak. And there is going to be a very, very wide range of health and beauty type products in there. By the way, happy Valentine's Day. Um, I hope you're all doing something that you love. I certainly am. Um, talking to you, obviously. So <laughs> I hope you have a fantastic day. So talking of products, yes. So that's health and beauty. And like I said to you, you will all get a pack of 50 at the Viva MK New Beginning Showcase. And again, I showed you some products last week, but here's some more of the men's products. You know, the, the, the packaging is absolutely beautiful. And, you know, and, and it's going to certainly create a new arena for us. So, you know, there's the, the it, it looks bright. It, and it'll look good on the page, and I do believe that it will sell. But you know what? The great thing is, whatever happens with whatever product range we have, we, we are flexible. You know, if, if we were trying to sell this and it didn't sell, we can remove it. We can put something else there. If we were trying to sell this and this range really worked well, we can introduce more of that range, which is the great thing of having a small, flexible, adaptable business. Like I've always told you, in big corporations, you sometimes lose that. Yes, there's advantages of huge corporations. Of course there are. But you can sometimes lose that personal touch that we can have. Now, every single day, I get hundreds of emails of what we can do, what we should do, and what, you know, some of your opinions are, which is fantastic, and keep that coming. Many of you keep asking about what the next catalog is going to be because now that health and beauty is in full production, well, it's in pre-production, but it, it, it it's almost there. It's almost ready. And you'll have copies of that in no more than nine days. You'll be taking that away and you'll be using that. You've seen the digital version of our New Beginnings catalog. All our catalogs will have a digital version like the one you've already seen. And I'll update you all if you haven't seen it in an email straight after this broadcast. So the next catalog, so health and beauty is all done. You've seen the products. You've seen what the pages look like. Not so much about the product there, but the boldness and the appeal of the pages. And that's really important where we're going forward. So the next catalog, and it's so new that I don't have an actual name for it yet, it will be based around outdoors and summer type products. So, you know, trying to capture that season. And as you know, to try and capture the outdoor and summer season, it really has to be around March, April time. So in March, we will produce an outdoor dash summer 
type catalog which will attract that audience it'll have the kind of things that you do use outdoors that you you know you need for the outdoors and represent summer um, and I think that again is going to have this kind of styling and as soon as I've got some pages to show you for that I will show you but that will be the next big production after health and beauty it will be and, and it, as I said I don't even have an actual name for it yet but but it will be based on outdoors, summer, you know, fun, sunshine, and all that kind of um, malarkey that we know sells in our kind of business. And as it's deemed to be, so the forecast tell us, it's going to be another impressively hot summer. So I think that couldn't come soon enough. So look out for that, and I'll tell you more about that as weeks go by. So that's the forthcoming catalogue. And I'll also try, like I keep telling you, is to have some kind of roadmap to tell you when catalogs are coming out it's sometimes a little bit difficult because we're trying to do everything all in one go but at least you now know the next catalog which is health and beauty followed shortly by an outdoor summer type catalog and i'll reveal the name to you and the front cover and some of the products that we will be in that catalog now you know i was saying to you earlier um the staff at HQ was trying to stitch me with products, so they gave me this product, which is quite rampant in my hand here, um, which is something that will be in the health and beauty product. So my my goal today is to try and work out what that does. Of course, I could just really look at the box and tell you, but what? where's the fun in that? So as far as I know, just briefly looking at the box, this is... And I really have no idea that there is a market for these, but there clearly is. Um, this is a makeup brush cleaner. So basically what happens, you get this piece here, you put this piece in here, and in here, and I don't, as you can imagine, have a makeup brush, but you put your makeup brush in there, and then you put that with the makeup brush in here, and then you press that, and apparently it cleans and then dries your makeup brush. And it has these different kind of implements that you can stick on the end of it. I think that it's very, very rubbery, and that's for a different size makeup brush. And you, as you can see, and I'm absolutely certain, I'm convinced that the reason I've been given this as a typical demonstration of one of the bigger health and beauty products is because somebody at head office found it really amusing. But anyway, that is, um, like I said, a makeup brush cleaner. In fact, it is, because it says on the box, makeup brush cleaner and dryer. I would never have known in all my years that you could even have such a product, but there you go. That's what it is. And I'm only showing you that because I showed you loads of products last week and it vibrates and anything that vibrates is always amusing. So that, you stick your brush in there and you put that in there and that cleans and then dries your brushes. I'm just gonna work out how to stop it vibrating now. So those are kind of products, as you've seen a great um, array of products I showed you last week, you know, some unique products, some products that will people will find, you know, are, are exceptionally um, a nice fragrance products, things they haven't seen. We'll also have a display of these at the showcase so you can touch and feel them and see what they're really like. Um, so we'll have a huge display of those that you can actually see what we, we've got there. I'll also try and have more information about the outdoor catalog. Also at the showcase, what I want to try and really reveal is um, some of the forthcoming catalogs that we've got and some of the forthcoming products and we've got some great ideas uh, again mostly coming from you guys some great ideas of what we can actually do to give us that niche in the market i know you've heard that word many many times but as a company i'm not trying to compete with anybody irrespective of being health and beauty or outdoor or vibrating brush cleaners it's not about competition it's about making a business Business where you are comfortable being in, you are valued in, and along the way, of course, making some money with some great products. But every company does 
have to have a niche that they're known for. At the moment, we're known as the people's business that came together out of nowhere just because we had faith in each other and we knew we could do this. Um, but as far as the customers are concerned, they don't really care about that. What they want is something to identify us with. Every company has to have an identification. And that's what we're trying to create. And I'll tell you some more about that at the showcase. So when people think of Viva MK, they associate it with something. They associate it with a brand. They associate it with a niche. So that way you'd end up centering a piece of the market. And that's what we need to try and do. And that is part of the strategy that I've been thinking about. And thank you for all your help on that because so many of you give so many ideas all of the time. And you know, and credit where it's due. Whenever I use something that is a valuable idea, I will give credit where it's due because as I said, a lot of the ideas do come from you guys. Now, like I said, next week, I'm going to do a live at six o'clock on Friday, so not on Thursday, and really, that is going to be the precursor to our showcase, which I, I keep telling you about, you know, it's the most important event I'll probably ever do. It's the most important event for those of you who can make it, you will ever attend, because it's our first event, um, you know, heralding where we've come from, what we are today and where we need to go. They're the three things that are about a celebration of people, where we've come from and why, um, where we've got to and where we are intending to go. And, you know, uh, as far as I'm concerned, I don't believe, and I've done many showcases, I'll ever do one more important, that first one. So if you can be there, of course be there. I know it's not always easy, to go to the center of Birmingham on a Sunday, but if you can, then you won't be disappointed because this showcase, this business is about you. It always has been and it always will be. And that will be a celebration of that. And as Sharon Davis quite rightly put in, thank you again for your support as long with everybody else. Um, you know, it, it, irrespective of what we talk about, it'll just be wonderful for great people to be getting together again. It's been a while since we've all been together in in one room, just celebrating the fact that we have enough passion, faith, believe, vision and attitude to build and to create anything we truly want. And we can and we are and we're doing it every day. Look, I know this competition. I don't see it that way because we still have our uniqueness, even without that cornered niche that I'm talking about. We still have our uniqueness thanks to the way you people are and the thanks to the way that we all connect. I know there's lots of businesses out there. They start every single day. You know, I've been in this industry for 25 years and not a month has gone by when there hasn't been the next best thing, the, the next big opportunity, the next ground floor opportunity. There hasn't been a month in all those years when that hasn't happened. And every single time we have still forged forward because for us, it wasn't just about the catalogs or the products. It was the unique connection of people. The businesses that we were in before, people enjoyed being in those businesses. It was a natural home to be, to connect and the way we work. And that is unique. The way you support each other, the way you support each other cross line, the way I'm hoping that the company supports you. That is a unique fixture for all of us. So yes, we have the products. Yes, we have the catalogs. Yes, we'll have the niche. Yes, we'll have the showcase, but the competition I don't give a damn, never have done, never will do, because I know we have a unique brand growing, and that unique brand is all about the people and our connection that we have. And again, you know, I can't thank you enough for that. I'll always, always be grateful for that because I well and truly know that it's not to do with me. It's not to do with any individual. You know, we've come away from those days when individuals thought it was all about them. I think we have all learned it is never about an individual. A one person alone cannot do bugger all. You have to be in this collective that we have today, this passionate 
attitude and belief that we have with a common vision to go forward. And on the 24th of February, what I will do is share more and more of that vision of how we're going to make it niche, how we're going to grow from our eight months forwards, how we're going to get to that first year and the first five years and how together we will keep doing that irrespective of anything happening in the marketplace. Like I've said to you, I don't care what's happening in the marketplace as long as we keep doing what we're good at. And that is unique in the way we connect and the way we go forward. Look, I don't want to take much more of your time today. I always appreciate you coming together on midday um, on a Thursday. Next week, we'll shake it up and I'll see you at six o'clock on Friday. And I'll tell you exactly how nervous I am about the showcase, which will be less than 48 hours away. Um, so I appreciate your time. It is Valentine's Day. I'm sure you've got to go out there and um, create the love. I, I don't really know what to say now, you know, but you, I'm, I'm sure you need to celebrate that. Me, I need to celebrate it because I carry on working on this amazing business. So thank you once again for joining me. Thank you for your time and everything you do and say to help construct the business that we all want. And you know what? Every single day, irrespective of what gets in our way, irrespective of the obstacles, we are getting over them. We are getting around them and we will keep going. And I guess I will see you next week. Have a fantastic day today. Thank you for joining me once again. Help and thank you for seeing me through this incredible product because um, I know, as I said, somebody clearly trying to stitch me up there and I'll see you next week. Take care. Thank you very much. Viva MK and thank you for doing everything you do. Bye.